Hey guys, welcome back to another video and in today's video I'm actually going to be doing something more soft on the eyes because I'm actually going to be doing a red slash burgundy wing eyeliner so I decided not to go too dramatic on the eyeshadows today I kept it really really soft and I am priming my eyes with this concealer and this one is by Maybelline I'm also going to be setting it with the white shade from the Renaissance palette which is called Tempera guys so I'm actually planning on doing chit chat videos like just talking through the videos instead of always doing voiceovers because I always do them and I just want you guys to get to know me a little more so I'm gonna be doing that on my next videos Next, I'm going in with this eyeshadow called Raw Sienna and I'm using this brush and it's the Morphe M441 and I'm applying this eyeshadow on my crease. I also got new makeup brushes and they are from Morphe as well, but I'm like so excited to use them. Like I get so happy whenever I get new brushes in the mail because I'm like, oh my god, these are like gonna be my favorite. I'm gonna be doing so many looks, so yeah, I'm very excited for that. I am going to be going in with a darker brown eyeshadow and a Morphe M433. I'm applying this on my crease as well, but I didn't get a lot of product on my brush because I didn't want my eye to be really, really dark of brown. So I added a little amount of eyeshadow on my crease. And I also did go back with the Morphe M441, which is a bigger and fluffier brush to blend everything together. You guys are probably like, really, another cut crease, but I just don't know what's up with me and cut creases. I just love doing them, but I know also I have been saying that I was going to have an eyebrow tutorial up very soon, but I have done the eyebrow tutorial four times and ju it just never wants to come out. Oh my god, I feel like I'm stuttering a lot. <laughs> but anyways, it doesn't want to come out. Like, I don't know what's up with my camera. I think it's on crack or something. <laughs> right here, I'm just patting down the concealer just to make sure everything is gonna be able to blend out so much easier and I'm also going to set it as well with the white shade from the same palette and then I'm going in with my Morphe M433 with the darker brown eyeshadow and applying it in the outer corner of my eye fading it towards the middle of my eyelid so for the eyeliner I'm actually going to be using a lipstick yes a lipstick oh my god i was so scared to do this because the first time i tried doing something like this it was a horrible mess like my eyes were like so red it looked like if i just got punched in the damn eye but anyways this time it actually worked for me i did use leo by kylie cosmetics and this is just a liquid lipstick you guys could use any burgundy or red lipstick you guys have it'll work as great but just be careful while doing this because it could get very messy and especially if you're using a different makeup brush it's not gonna work as great as if you use a eyeliner brush this is an eyeliner brush by Tarte so it worked great for me I actually use this one for my black eyeliner but I washed it and I used it for the red eyeliner instead because uh, I don't think I'll be able to do eyeliner with any other brush if it's not this one. Isn't it this eyeliner so pretty? Like, I was so shook while doing this. I'm like, damn, how did my eyeliner come out looking so damn good? Okay, I added some highlighter to my inner corner of my eye. But at the end of the video, I went in with a gold glitter eyeshadow. It wasn't even eyeshadow, it was glitter. And I applied it in the inner corner of my eye just so it could pop out a lot more. So you guys could go ahead and do that with any glitter you guys would like. But if you guys don't want to add glitter, that's totally fine. You guys could leave it as it is or you guys could add any eyeshadow to the inner corner. It'll look just as beautiful. For eyelashes, you guys know which ones I'm going to be using. Low, low PMs and I'll have them linked down below in case you guys love them as much as I do. <laughs> and after applying eyelashes, I am all finished. I will be back with longer videos so make sure to stay tuned and be subscribed. And well, that is it. I will see you guys on my next video. Don't forget to give me a huge thumbs up before you leave. Bye.